a special report from NBC News. We've uh, spoken several times today regarding this matter. This is David Gascon from the LAPD, the Los Angeles Police Department, talking about the two counts of murder that have been filed against O.J. Simpson. After an exhaustive investigation, which included interviews of dozens of witnesses, a thorough examination and analysis of the physical evidence, both here and in Chicago, sought and obtained a warrant for the arrest of O.J. Simpson, charging him with the murders of Nicole Brown Simpson and Ronald Lyle Goldman. Mr. Sim Simpson, in agreement with his attorney, was scheduled to surrender this morning to the Los Angeles Police Department. Initially, that was 11 o'clock. It then became 11.45. Mr. Simpson has not appeared. The Los Angeles Police Department right now is actively searching for Mr. Simpson. Commander Gascon, didn't you have a tail on the suspect all the time? Were you watching him constantly? We're uh, not going to make any comments relative to the investigative efforts itself or anything else surrounding what has occurred since the beginning of the case. Well, how through, did you lose him? You asked the question, would you like for me to answer? We have spoken to Mr. Shapiro. We have expressed our dismay, and uh, we have indicated to him that uh, that we expect to see Mr. Simpson immediately, if not sooner. You're going to have to hold it down one at a time, or I won't be able to hear you. Has Shapiro seen him today at all, Commander? Well, it's my understanding uh, that he has. Can you account for and why he's not can Mr. Shapiro account for why Mr. Simpson has not turned himself in? Well, apparently he cannot. Uh, he assured us and agreed to provide for this surrender, and that's not occurred. And it was delayed on several occasions, and it still has not occurred. And to the best of my knowledge, Mr. Simpson is out there somewhere, and we will find him. Uh, homicide investigations are complicated investigations. They require a tremendous amount of skill and patience by detectives. We have some of our absolutely best detectives on this case. They've been very methodical. They've done a tremendous job. Uh, they, they deserve to be complimented for their efforts. Uh, as I indicated, they're very complicated. There's no rush to judgment on these types of investigations. You have to keep an open mind. Uh, they are, as I indicated, uh, among the very best we have. And there is no preferential treatment. There has not been any preferential treatment. And uh, I think you will see with the commitment of department resources in pursuit of Mr. Simpson that he is a wanted murder suspect and we will go find him. Can you address the uh, reports we heard earlier today about a second suspect? Is OJ Simpson the only suspect? Here? Again, we're not going to dignify any of the rumors. Uh, uh, we believe we know who's responsible for the crime. We, we certainly have, uh, to, uh, to the degree of satisfaction necessary to us uh, to obtain a warrant, uh, we believe him to be the suspect, and that's why we're looking for him now. Do you think he's still in the Los Angeles area? Well, it's our assumption at this point that he is, and uh, we'll see what transspires. Do, do the, uh, Commander, Commander, Commander? Commander? Yes, sir. Is he considered armed and dangerous at this time? Well, Mr. Simpson is a wanted murder suspect, two counts of murder, a terrible crime. We need to find him, we need to apprehend him, we need to bring him to justice and we need to make sure that we find him as quickly as possible. That's Commander David Gascon from the Los Angeles Police Department with one of the most stunning announcements you're ever going to hear on live television. O.J. Simpson, one of this country's best-known personalities, is a suspect in a double homicide, a terribly gruesome crime, and he is at large tonight. There is now a statewide manhunt underway for O.J. Simpson in California. As you heard the commander say that he now believes that the State Highway Patrol and all units of the LAPD PD have been put on alert to look for him. There are arrangements have been made with Robert Shapiro, who is O.J. Simpson's lawyer, for him to turn himself in at 2 o'clock Eastern time this afternoon at 11 this morning West Coast time. When he failed to appear by 11.45, the Los Angeles Police Department expressed their grave unhappiness with the lawyer. But at this hour, it's now three hours past that time, 
O.J. Simpson remains at large. He is a wanted and hunted murder suspect at this time. Who could have thought that it would come to this with this man who was so beloved in this country for so long? But now, his ex-wife and a man, a young man who was visiting her at the time, apparently just coincidentally, lay dead, and O.J. Simpson is the prime suspect. In the formal complaint, he has been charged with willfully and unlawfully and with malice, killing both of them with a knife. And there are special circumstances in the formal complaint as well. That means that O.J. Simpson could be facing the death penalty. It's hard for us to state the magnitude and the importance of this case because the fact of the matter it is, it boggles the imagination.